Uh, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just offering a different opinion. Um, Cause you have a, that's a mad valid point, right? Um, they are wrapping it like Pax G have a one-to-one -one reserve to make those smart contracts. Yeah, I'm not worried about the technical stuff. I'm not worried about getting down that low, honestly. I'm just saying that I prefer how Cardano's doing it because Cardano's saying, I'm not just gonna do one or two. They're, they're whole, the idea is they're going, they wanna be a, a layer. They wanna be a platform for interoperability. That's a use case that needs to be real. They're making it real, Cardano is, and that has long-term, you know, positive upswing to it. Hence, I like the way Cardano is doing it versus how others are doing it. But down to the nitty gritty, I, yeah, I'm not worried about that right now. They, most people don't have to worry about the nitty gritty, you know, technical stuff. I don't get down that far sometimes. Very rare. If it's if it's a private, you know, conversation, we could take we could go deeper. But for the broader spectrum of people, that's not what's going to matter. What's going to matter is having the interoperability. I think that's the big deal. I think it does matter as you as you cross that that Rubicon and you say, oh, there's interoperability. Once you once you fathom that and you want to learn more about it, that's when getting down a, a couple of more layers is going to make a difference to you because it's going to make a difference to how you do your own research and especially knowing your entries, knowing your exits, because that will enable you to absolutely invest deliberately. So, yeah, it's kind of like a graduation kind of thing. You, you're going to you're going to gain some knowledge. You're going to get used to that knowledge. You're going to seek out more knowledge. 